हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू स्किल एजुकेशन एंड लर्निंग फोरम इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस टाइप्स ऑफ मोल्डिंग सैंड वाइल लर्निंग कास्टिंग प्रोसेस वी कम अक्रॉस वराइटी ऑफ मोल्डिंग सैंड्स लाइक ग्रीन सैंड पेसिंग सैंड इन सैंड कास्टिंग पैटर्न इज यूज टू फॉर्म molds or cavities in sand the sand used in forming such molds is molding sand depending upon the use there are following types of molding sand green sand dry sand loam sand facing sand backing sand system sand parting sand and core sand let's discuss each of them one by one the first one is green sand it is building block for molds the sand contains about 8% moisture in it hence it is termed as green sand let me tell you that it does not have green in color it is silica with 20% clay it is fine sand it is soft porous and most importantly when pressed it retains shape the next is dry sand green sand when dried in molds by heating is called as dry sand molds are need to be prepared and then they are baked before pouring molten metal next is loam sand loam sand it contains loams it contains 50% clay so the sand is sticky black and it is used to prepare skeleton patterns and it is also used in loam molding next is facing sand it is very fine mixture of green sand and specially prepared sand with sea coal coal is used to prevent burning of sand this sand is used to form face of the mold and it directly comes in contact with molten metal it should have good refractory properties the next sand is backing sand after layer of facing sand backing sand is used to fill the molds this sand is recycled again and also called as floor sand it is cheaper the next sand is system sand in machine molding it is not possible to use facing and backing sand separately for mass production system sand is used to fill complete mold this sand is reused by addition of water and binder and special additives in it next is parting sand it is very fine silica dust which is non sticky it is used to keep green sand from sticking to the pattern it is used at parting surface parting surface is surface joining cope and drag it is used at parting surface for ease of removal of molds hence it is it is called as parting sand next is core sand as the name implies 
it is used for making cores. It is mixture of silica and mineral oil. Cores are used for making hollow castings. It should have good collapsibility. In summary, green sand is building block for molds. Dry sand is obtained after drying of green sand. Loam sand contains loams. Facing sand is the very first sand which comes in contact with molten metal and it forms face of the mold. Then backing sand is for backing of the facing sand. System sand is used in machine molding. Parting sand is used at parting surface and core sand is used for making cores. So these are types of sands. I hope you understand the variety of sands used in casting. If you have any question, please comment in comment section below. Please subscribe the channel. Thank you.